Storm's impact continues with Volusia County. If your home was damaged during the storm, you are not alone. Western Scott Heiler followed a response disaster team making their rounds. In Volusia County, we traveled with a local water disaster recovery team for the first time that they were able to get out there and help people since Ian traveled offshore. Now that the water has stopped rising, the clock is ticking to act on the prevention of mold colonization in your home. Teams from local Edge Water Company First Response Disaster Team, founded by husband and wife Ken and Anne Marie Pullen, are clicking into gear. We couldn't mobilize trucks yesterday, so we were just chomping. Um, we've got probably 350 units that are wet right now, so we're going to have a busy couple of weeks here for sure. Their first stop, a nursing home. They take readings and start the drying out process. It could take weeks. If you had standing water in your house, you need to start airing it out, and the dry air we have right now helps. Open the windows in your house, and if you still have electricity, turn on the ceiling fans or run air conditioners with the windows closed. Get valuables up and pick up soaked area rugs. And most importantly, don't panic, number one, and understand that it can be fixed. Don't get overwhelmed. We see a lot, we've had a lot of tears on the phone this morning. Before a mold prevention or water damage team arrives, say the couch has had four feet of water or three feet of water. If it's ruined, get it out of the house, take plenty of pictures of it. Don't throw anything away unless it's photoed, even if you think it's not going to be paid for. Photo document. Ken also said that many folks don't understand the details of their insurance policies. While they might have flood insurance that actually covers the house itself, it doesn't cover the contents inside your stuff. So read the fine print and get some expert advice. In Volusia County, Scott Heidler, West 2 News.